This is the partial quotients division algorithm. Basically, the idea of partial quotients is instead of trying to divide directly into the number as many times as possible, to basically chip away bit by bit at the dividend um, using the divisor. So the first thing we do is draw a line down the side. This is going to separate my uh, remainders from my actual quotient. So my first thought is how many 12s go into 195? And again, I'm trying to keep this simple. So I always want to use things like 10s and 100s, um, numbers that end in zero that I can multiply easier in my head. So I think right away how much is 10 20s, and that's 120, which will go into 90, 195. So I put my 10 on the outside, and I do 10 times 20, it's 120 on the inside. And I subtract like I would in normal division. Now I look at 12, and I think about how many times it can go into 75. Now, depending on whether or not I know my 12 times tables, I may know directly it's going to go, you know, six times, or I may not. Um, so even if I know if I, do, I may not, let's say I, I miscalculate and I say oh, it goes five times and that's 60. The good thing about the partial quotients method is I can still get the correct answer even though I had a minor problem. So now I say 12 into 15. Now I can go one more time for my 12, subtract. I get my remainder in here. On the outside, now that I know the 12 won't go into 3, I'm going to stop. What I'm going to do is add up my quotients on the outside, and I'm always careful to line up my columns, 1s and 10s. So then I have a final answer of 16 remainder 3.